for you who are awakening, be empowered, be healed, be loved. Welcome to my health and happiness tip this week. I want to talk about asthma, also called COPD, and what you can do for yourself or how you can help others besides the medical treatment. How do you notice that you have COPD? You are breathless, you do cough, you produce more sputum and you get tired. So there are three root causes. One is allergic, the other one is non-allergic, and the third one is the combination. So the allergic one can be caused by allergens and genetic disposition. The non-allergic can be called by exposure to cold air or infection, but also medication and chemicals and reflux can cause it as well. And the emotional and physical stress that we all have can cause an acute, an acute asthma attack as well. So what can you do for yourself or help others? I have five tips for you. The first is, of course, logically, avoid the exposure to those allergens. When you go to a physician and they test, you know, that you don't try to uh, inhale those kind of things. And also avoid smoke, germs, cold air, if possible, fog, painkillers that contain acetyl salicyl acid. The second is choose the right physical training. So everything that's good for your endurance is very good. Yeah, uh, Not so much those physical trainings that have rapid movements and exhausting movements. The third is that I want to show you a certain physical therapeutical technique that we used to do in Germany all the time. I call it coachman on a carrier posture connected with a lip break technique. What do I mean? Please put your elbows on a surface or on your knees and lean on your knees, on your elbows. The, the second thing is that the breathing out becomes very important. Watch my lips. When I breathe out, I actually make a lip break so that I breathe out slowlier and more precise. I do it again. Leaning on your elbows and the lip break techniques, those two techniques help you to get the air out because a lot of people think that the asthma people need to get the air in, but what their real problem is, is that they need to get the air out. So that's the trick, yeah? Get the air out. Then another thing is that you relax, you learn how to relax. Of course, there are many techniques on the market. What I offer is my meditations, meditation CDs and also the body organization that helps to align and to bring everything into a good connection and balance. The fifth tip that I have is that you educate yourself properly. Um, with books, with self-help tips and so on. Also ask the physician, the special, specialist about information that you need. I also offer private sessions where we find out the more precise root causes and also the more precise and tailored solutions for you. So I hope this helps and if you have more questions feel free to ask me. Thank you for listening. Bye-bye. The Willow System, the feminine art of healing.